Pollux the Wise, I mean, the Real Morgan YouTube channel featuring Pollux the Wise. Okay, so what we're doing today is something kind of new and interesting for me. It's not too different from what I've done with Vaduk in completing this level for an endless challenge, but I, I don't know what this footage is, and I'm not going to do any edits, so if I stutter or say words the wrong way, which I do quite a lot, actually, then I'm just going to leave it in there because I want this to be raw, unedited, uncut. So that's that's what we're going with. Now, this footage uh, <laughs> so far is is pretty funny. Okay, <laughs> so he he's dropping bombs. Uh, I I think I get the troll that uh, that Pollux, the Rivet Master McGee here, is going for. Yeah, obviously he's doing all Templars with Bruxa. I'm I'm not 100% sure why he chose Bruxa. She's obviously very good, but I feel like Boneheart would be. Uh, I don't know. He just dominates everything. Ulrich is really good for Reaper Lords, but not good for Swarms. So I would I would personally choose Bonefart. Um, but yeah, the Templars are actually they're actually faring pretty well so far. This is a this is a shock. Okay, so he was about to die. So we got another bomb. Oh, another another bomb. I I think when Morgan was editing this, he might have did he miss one? I don't know. I'm not gonna rewind it though. Bomb number four. <laughs> okay, so Bruxa, yeah, she's definitely there for the birds. And that makes sense because you don't want to have to have like one archer in the back. That's just, it defeats the whole like spam one tower type, you know, strategy that I usually go with. Okay, bomb five. <laughs> I mean, do I see anything wrong with this strategy? No. Okay, so he's finishing off these Reapers the old fashioned way. I don't know how I missed it, but he sold every single one of his towers. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> or they just turned invisible. Maybe it's an item that I haven't heard of before, but wow, that is, uh, that is an inter interesting strategy, Cotton. We'll see if it pays off. All right, so we're going to give him a 10 out of 10 as a good troll for Templars turning invisible and dropping bombs. You cannot beat that strategy. That was pretty epic. But, uh, you know, the cons, he could have just eaten everyone like he did in Vengeance, so... Uh, that was sad. 